Hello, here is Moon and here is another challenge log. This time it's first CL unnamed by Golden Steel. Made out of no name, well not quite no name, guard security. I am not aware of the name, let's put it this way. Padlock was nice brand name S Biner. That's a cool island, just like her binars. The key we will leave as it is. It's not opening, by the way. And yeah, let's see if I can pick it. Straight away, I notice it's, it has very sharp corners, so it's not very comfortable to hold. But I hope it will not take long enough to make it an issue. Using a deep hook for a multi pick for that. And let's see what's in the back. There is some click on pin number six. Assuming it's a six five four, click there, go rotation three. Oh, it might be actually five pinner. Doesn't matter. Something out of one. And let's go to the back again. Last one, another click. In the middle, it's like springy, nothing. Number two is counter rotating and click there. Two. Three, four, click on four, five, another click on five, something happened, I'm not sure why, and I got a deeper fall set and yeah, well, deeper fall set only goes with a core rotation, another click on two, one is binding strongly. I hope not to lose my tensioner. And it's open. Nice. Oh, I'm not sure you can see it, but let me get a light. It's fun that there is a cutout and a shackle for the um, for the ball bearing. But there is none. Just some stud. It's definite. Well, maybe it is. I don't think it's a ball. I don't think it will come out far enough. Let's poke it a little with a. Oh well, it actually is a ball. Sorry, all good. Ball there. And the screws there. And the cutting kit is there. So let's see what do we have inside. Um, how do I get to that key? Do I really need a knife for that? Or can I just unwrap it? Yep, yeah, I can. Let's have a look at the key. It'll go. That seems to be hand filed. Or some nice bitting. Five pinner, mild ones in the front. How are, is it five or six? Regardless, we'll see. And at the back there is a deep cut and a high lift. The padlock is real heavy. It weights quite a lot. I guess it's steel. 
E. Well, it did rotate once. And here is another time. Works well enough. So let's get to the best part. The guts. GNS, whatever that means, golden steel, all right, get it, six pin core, let's see how many is actually there. We don't need any surprises. Six pin. And the key pins were filed while being in core. So we have those grooves and quite thick shear line. High lift, low lift higher lift and three middle ones. Key pins look like they're pretty standard. Nothing special about them. The core is also pretty stock aside from this file marks. So let's have a look at the best part. A spool, a hand filed one. Another hand filed spool. Serrated. Serrated, smaller serrated, and the last one is serrated again. Springs, ah crap, I have no idea which way the springs go, or which is which. Some of them are stronger, I would guess the first one is, should have paid more attention. So again, I will have to, con to confirm the spring placement with the original maker. Anyways, here are the springs, spools in one and two and nice homemade serrated in the rest. That's pretty much it. Thank you for watching.